In the next video, we're going to go over a quick guide on how to pass and counter the single leg X guard. Enjoy! Like with any type of guard, the first thing you want to do is to address what is bothering you while trying to pass. So first, start by breaking your opponent's grip, that can be either on your collar, on your leg or on your sleeve. The second thing you want to address is the foot that is on your hip. That is the foot that is controlling the distance between you and your opponent. After clearing your opponent's foot, post your hand above your opponent's head and backstep. Switch your hips and finish in a side control. Use your free hand to push your opponent's legs to the ground while backstepping. The most common reaction you'll get after backstepping is your opponent will try to get the underhook and recover his guard. So right after backstepping, switch your hips and put pressure on your opponent's elbow to prevent him from coming up to his knees. Then top spin over his head and finish in a side control on the other side or take the back. When doing the top spin, make sure to step over your opponent's head. Block your opponent's stomach with your elbow and finish the top spin. The next reaction we'll go over is when your opponent will try to push you away from him to get enough distance to recover his guard. This is a perfect opportunity to combine speed passing with pressure passing. Grab your opponent's collar, step back and jump to the other side, finishing in a leg drag. Keep in mind that when you backstep you want to hold your opponent's leg. So when you grab the collar you have two good grips to pass your opponent open guard from a distance. Now we're going to counter attack the guard with a spinning back take. Instead of fighting with the foot that is on our hip, we're going to go with it. Push your opponent's foot down, step back and grab your opponent's pants. Then step over your opponent's hip and roll forward to take his back, doing a berimbolo from the top. After rolling forward, make sure to stomp with your legs on the floor, switch your hooks to secure the back. For the next pass, we're going to address the foot that's in between our legs. Push your opponent's leg down, step back, and then pull your opponent's leg on top of your hip. Swim under your opponent's leg, grab the belt, and stack your opponent forward. Then dive under your opponent's hips, switch your legs, and take the back. Make sure that when you stack your opponent and dive under his hips, wedge your knee in between his knee and his hip. Then pull your opponent's hips on top of you, switch the hips and climb to the back. Thank you so much for watching. If you do enjoy this video, make sure to like, subscribe and press the notification bell to get notified of my upcoming videos. If you have any requests for videos, let me know in the comment below and make sure to follow me on Instagram for more Jiu Jitsu content.